Here we go, folks. Uh, Inktober for day three, which, um, let me look at my calendar. Day three is what day of the week? Come on, give me the whole calendar. Not just that. I want the whole calendar. Thank you. October, day three, Tuesday. Okay, this is Tuesdays. And we're going to do poison. Obviously, when you think of poison, you think of like poison apple, um, something like that. I'm thinking somebody wanted me to do um, a pattern and it's called pepper. And I can't show you the step out because it is an official Zentangle one and I don't have permission to show that step out, but I'm happy to show you how to do the tangle. You um, start with a very light string roundy kind of shape. And I'm gonna make a poisoned pepper. And I'm gonna do it right in here and I'm gonna make it that shape not quite round, but kind of round-ish, right like that. Barely, you can barely, barely see the line. Can you see it? Just barely. And all you do with pepper is make triangular-ish shapes that move toward the center. And I'm gonna go to about, see where this kind of like white-ish area is? I'm gonna leave that. I'm gonna make use of this colors on here. So I'm going to make a triangular-ish shape. Kind of like that. And I'm just going to come around and make more of those triangular-ish shapes. It's a lot like um, Oh, what's the darn one I'm thinking of? Ina, it's one of yours. <sighs> Beautiful underwater sea urchin-y looking ones. I missed a spot here. I'm going to make it just a teeny tiny one like that. came out really weird shaped. Okay, well, that's the shape it's gonna be. I want this one in here. Um, some of the more difficult patterns are uh, are already done on um, Ellen Walters channel if you look up on YouTube and you and you do uh, search for Ellen Walters I think it's W O L T E R S um, she does a lot of patterns especially ones that are a little more complex um, when she did hers, when she put her like sparkle kind of in here, I think I want my sparkle to go this way. I think. You know what? I'm going to fill it in with, I'm actually going to use a bigger pen so that I don't take like all day to fill it in. And I'm gonna use my brown, where'd brown go? One of these browns, which brown do I wanna use? The kind of purpley brown? Maybe you wanna use this kind of purpley brown. Ah, perfect color.
And you can just leave a little spot like that for like a sparkle. And I think I may come back to that spot and highlight it actually with the white pen. Actually, maybe I'll fill them in and I'll just come back with my white pen and do sparkles, I think. So the person who asked for this, her name is Pepper. I'm assuming that's why she wants this tangle. It's, I think it's named pepper after like a peppermint. See, I really didn't even really need that string around the edge. It just helps you to get a kind of a roundish shape. You really didn't need it. You could dry it without. this sooner than later because I think my son will be home from work soon and he'll come in clomping and thumping and making all sorts of noise So in my little scenario here for Inktober, the Wicked Witch is giving out poisoned candies to the little children for Halloween. And this is the poisoned peppermint. That's why it's a weird color. Okay. So I'm going to put a little bit of shading right along, right along here. You know, why can't I remember your the name of your tangle? It's it, it's almost exactly just like this. You draw these, and it just arrives. It's almost just the same, except you don't fill it in like like little triangles. I'm gonna do this. I'll think of it eventually. It'll come to me. Hopefully it'll come to me before I post this video and then I'll be able to, uh, cause it's one of my favorites. Goodness sakes, why can't I remember it? I'll put it in the description box. Just like it. Why can't it? Why are you not talking to me, little tile? It'll come to me. I know it will. There we go. Just a little bit of shading. Give it some 
shape, some dimension, and I'm going to put some highlights right in here. Just like that. Some spots are shinier than others. Here we go. There is one poisoned pepper for Inktober. I want it to live this way. Okay, Inktober, poison. That didn't take too long. I was afraid it was taking a long time, but it didn't take too long. So that's a good thing. All right, you guys have a really great day. I will see you tomorrow. Bye.